What's all this? this uh, <laughs> that's something to do with me. Right, it's a karaoke, right. Uh, hello, everyone. Yeah. Now, is it best if I stand here when the um, rather meagre spotlight is? <laughs> um, yeah, I'll stand. I'll start here anyway. Uh, and I'll just pour myself a nice glass of um, still water. <laughs> that's the kind of crazy person that I am. <laughs> How are we all? All right? We're good. Yeah. So, are you looking forward to uh, the weekend? Yeah! Good. I've just been saying down the bottom there that it's um, usually when you, you know, if I'm here and normally I might do a sort of Sunday lunchtime when everyone's got a stinking hangover. <laughs> you know, it's been through sort of 36 hours of heavy drinking. And, um, and here I am when you're really bright and fresh and just very pissed. <laughs> different feel to the, to the whole evening. There's Andrew, and he's still balancing on one leg, so he's, uh, he's only had the three gallons so far. So, uh, so, so yeah, I, will, I'm, I'm I'm, I have bent over backwards, so to speak, um, once in 1978. Um, to get here this, this weekend, it's a very busy weekend for me, but um, I have, as I say, moved mountains to be here, and I've really, um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Usually it's the ball for perhaps coming in, but you know, okay. here I am. So I'm very, very honoured to be here. Uh, it's always a good gig, and um, I'm still intrigued by this karaoke business. Here. So, um, but I'm always, I could really mess it up, couldn't I? <laughs> DVDs, CDs, sorry, I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, anyway, all of school, that. Let's, let's have a question, shall we not, to, um, to, to, to get things kicked off with, and then uh, we'll, um, we'll see what that takes us. Hands up who wants to ask a question. I'll go right to the right here, and I'll, uh, the girl in the red t-shirt there. I'm just a casting agency, and I'm not having much luck. Any advice? Aww. That's a rather serious question, isn't it? Um, <laughs> Just join a, a casting agency or an agency? Well, maybe you should uh, try and do a. Have you got a sort of demo video or something? Or a no? show reel, that's what it's called? No? Um, have you been to a, an actual proper agent who can sort of get on the, the phone or the uh, emails to sell you properly? No? Have you had a good photograph done? <laughs> well, there's three things you can do. Spread the net nice and wide. Uh, yeah, this, this right. Spread the net far and wide so that you get as many people sort of selling your wares as possible, yeah? Aww. Well, try it again. <laughs> and if it doesn't work, try it again and again. What did Robert Bruce say? Don't give up, basically. So you've just got to keep, yeah. And if they don't do anything for you, get rid of that agency and go on to another one. But it's, it really is. I've had five agents in my first year in show business, so. And you know, I stuck with one of them eventually, but they say that changing agents is like changing deck chair on the Titanic. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so somewhere along the line, someone will spot your talent. It may not be this year, but it may be five years' time. Keep, keep at it. Next question. Um, ch chap at the back of the glasses. Uh, did you ever consider doing the rubber for the show and submitting any script ideas or plot ideas for any episodes? Um, no. <laughs> I'm a shit writer. Uh, I didn't really want to test Doug's patience with, uh, you know, of how he'd be able to say, Chris, no. Uh, Ed Barney used to do it very well. He used to sort of, if we suggested something just in a scene, he would sort of go, um, yes, I, I can see where you're coming from, but um, I'm not like that. <laughs> so, if I'd submitted any ideas, then Doug would have asked me lots of serious questions. You know, like, well, what happens then? And I wouldn't, wouldn't have any answer. So I was just, you know, I'd just rather sit in the uh, coffee bar and wait till the, the lines come. You know, doing the acting is, is, is enough. Let's not, let's not try and take on too much, yeah? yeah. From my own point of view. I'm not a writer. Right, well, I'm kind of a writer, yeah, but not a comedy script writer. Robert, though, is obviously a very well qualified and proficient writer. Um, 
please tell him that I'm singing his praises. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and he's very good at it, so, uh, you know, there we go. Uh, next question. Um, girl there with glittery things on her front. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but... Um, Hello, Mr. Barry, sir. Hello, sir. Oh, Hello, Barry. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining us. Um, I like to sing, and as you are well aware, karaoke is on this evening. Would you do me on a please of singing a duet with me? or Arnold River. Which we have two. That's a very good question. I would probably choose to go with Gordon Brittas. Because he would keep the place tidy. He would encourage me to help him keep the place tidy. Um, and he probably wouldn't drink much of the alcohol. <laughs> um, River, unfortunately, would probably go completely spare after two days and try and murder me in the middle of the night. <laughs> so, so uh, yeah, I think Brenna is a slightly, you know, he's, he's probably more sane, is basically what I'm saying, you know, but completely mad. So, <laughs> um, so yeah, I, I would, I'd probably pick Brenna's, yeah. Um, which is no disrespect to Rimsey, who obviously I owe my life to. Um, but he just would not be a hell of a laugh to be on a little bit.